All right, you guys. I'm gonna be showing you how to uh, remineral. Me, ah, I can't even say remineralize your distilled water. All right. I know some people say out there that uh, drinking distilled water just all the time is not good for you, but there's no scientific proof on that. It's what it does. It's just pretty much just you know goes in and it pretty much just vaporizes all the water, turns it into vapor, and then. Um, the drops that come out of it look let me show you what comes out of it is pure water um, it loses its structure because it's like a like restructured some people say that you can freeze it and get the structure back and uh, you can do it that way or you can just use uh, see it dripping you can just use just simple some some lemon and uh, or some uh, uh, salt but I use the, uh, usually you want to just use the uh, pink Himalayan salt. Um, and it just gives it its structure back. I'm not going to go into uh, all that detail and all that, but it, it loses its structure because it's been forced, you know, under pressure, heat, and then it's just that the vapor, what vaporizes it and it drips into the, into this, uh, one gallon container. You can see it dripping there. But uh, this Mega Home uh, distiller is really nice. It's a real nice distiller. It's on the higher end. Uh, let me see something. It's on the higher end of distillers, but you can. Uh, there's three. Th this one has like three different models. I have the the thing here. What it came in. Um, like these different models. This one here is the one I have. It's the stainless steel one. Um, I think this one's the cheapest one. This one's $219. I'm not sure what these ones are, but these ones are, I think, the lower ends. This one looks kind of smaller by the picture, but maybe not. Um, no, they're all about the same size. So, but yeah, it'll come in a box like this and uh, then it'll have the mark of which one it is but yeah this one is the one a uh, little higher end one and uh, it works great so far I definitely like to drink a lot of water and a lot of Gatorade and the thing about it is that uh, I want to drink the best water because our tap water is real it's okay here it's no I'm not going to say it's okay it's not good at all the tap water um, once it's distilled and you you're able to open this unit up take the top off here and look inside here it actually looks like oil there's a, a video on YouTube and I'll link it uh, down below and uh, you can check it check it out it's when the guy uh, does the test on he does a test on uh, tap water um, reverse osmosis and distilled water he does a three-way test on it reverse osmosis does okay but you still have uh, you know your trace elements in there and uh, heavy metals and stuff like that this distiller takes all that stuff out of there uh, the heavy metals the uh, pollutants but once you open this up and you look down there and you see what's actually in your tap water it's disgusting it looks like a sludge uh, oily type stuff and that's going into your system so you definitely know you don't want to have that going into your system um, but yeah, this thing is really nice. You can see I make my Gatorade with it. Um, so I'm going to just point this over here and I'll show you guys real quick how to uh, just remineralize your water. I can't say that for some reason. Um, but yeah, you just want to put some minerals back into it because it does take, it takes, it's 100% water. I mean, it's just like, it's been distilled, it's, it's pure 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 but you, you do lose your minerals and stuff like that and you can just replace them very simply by just adding either using some lemon or you can use this uh, uh, pink Himalayan salt that I have here yeah that works great too so basically all you do is just get your glass here whatever you're going to do if you're going to uh, make you, you can make a separate one glass and just do a uh, lemon wedge or if you're going to do your whole gallon, you can just simply, once you get it filled up, and let your water set too. You can go do your research on water and stuff like that. Water needs to like a, it's kind of like wine actually, you know. you got to let it, it 
can sit for a second, let it sit for a little while. What I like to do is I like to actually let it sit and then I go set it outside because I live in Arizona, so like I get a lot of sun. I like to give it a sun blast too. So, but you don't have to do that, but I mean, I'm just, I'm sure the sun does some kind of effect on it also too. So, because it's out in the open and it's, you know, it's not sitting in pipes and sitting, it loses, even like when it's sitting in your, in your pipes, in your house, I mean, it's losing structure. Water is a very unique thing, so, but I'm not going to go all into that, so I'm just going to show you how to remineralize it, okay? So, this is just from the gallon from one of the, uh, from this here, and this is a real nice one gallon uh, glass, and I also like to just use glass, too. If you can use like glass, use glass instead of putting it back in plastic, because you know that has, you know, that's problem, problematic, too. So, it's got a lot of junk in it also oil you know all plastic comes from oil anyway so you know that's getting into your water especially like with water bottles and if you're sitting out in arizona here you leave it in your car and it's sitting there it's breaking down into the water that oil and all that stuff you know the plastic is oil so that's breaking down you know putting trace chemicals into your system so anyway um just go ahead and put your lemon or your lemon i'm sorry and pop it, if there's any seeds in there, just pop out the seeds so you don't get it in there. And you don't need a lot of it in your water. It's just going to, and you can do it individually also if you want. But I just usually just put a little bit in there like that. And then I just take a little bit of this salt and all you need is just a little pinch of this too. This stuff will just last forever. And then just literally a pinch of it. And just put it in there. And then basically stir on the spoon. Or you can just let it sit or you can shake it up however you want to do it. And that's pretty much it. And if you just want to do a single glass, of course you're just going to put your water in there. Let's see. And I know everyone's seen this. This has already got some lemon, actually the extra lemon in here, so. That's out of the fridge. And you can, if you want to, you can just even just basically freeze your water after you've distilled it because it's going to, uh, it just restructurizes it because it's been broke down. So then we just basically just get you a lemon wedge. And put a little on it like you do at a restaurant or at your home or whatever. I'm sure you know how to do it. And that's it. And you're just remineralizing your water. That's simple. So, you guys, that's it. If you like this video, like it. And uh, any comments. And uh, be sure to subscribe. Alright, until next time. Uh, that's my choice, huh? What's yours?